I messed up. Um, since both castings on these heads are the same, I was trying to just go by the casting over and I messed up and just not followed orientation of things. So when you see down here, inside this hole, See how it's kind of where it doesn't line up in there? Well, whoops, my light fell. Well, if you notice in the back here, you got the two holes there. And then on the front down there, you don't have two holes. So here on the exhaust side here, see how they have the bolt hole and then this hole here. So, this head needs to go over there with the two holes in the back. Um, yeah, so now I gotta <laughs> order a new set of head, head bolts and a gasket, and that's gonna set me back. <sighs> I don't know, about a week, depending on. But anyway, just make sure you take it off in sequence, the right sequence. I'm just kind of breaking them loose in the sequence. And then I'll go back through the sequence and take them all off. Like, completely loosen them. But that sucks. <clears throat> I mean, rookie mistake. Okay, so I took the head off. Made a mistake of flipping it around. So this has one hole and that has two holes. So we have to make sure that the two holes goes towards the back. <clears throat> well, I mean, this is the other head. But the other mistake that I did make that I noticed is when I took the head off, there was just oil all over the place. I think what I was doing was, was putting too much oil on the bolts when I put them down into the, when I, you know, went to thread them, I think I just put too much oil. You know, so what I did is I just flipped this around, as you can see down there. I just flipped it around and then just let it all the oil drain out of the holes. It's still lubricated, so um, I'm not going to be able to finish both sides of the heads today. But I can finish at least this driver's side, <clears throat> get the um, push rods measured. Um, and then I'll do the passenger side when I get the other gas head gasket and the other um, head bolts. So, but yeah, so let me, that was just kind of wanted to let you know my other mistake. Messed it up. Had the head gasket on backwards too. <laughs> Man, I just did a bunch of stuff. I don't know why I didn't follow the orientation of these holes. Um, I was more focused on this. And I was following this on the head gasket and um, but on this side you see how it's just a regular square but then you have the curved side here that's on the back and this one's on the front so you have to make sure that this with the two holes is orientated correctly so <clears throat> so make sure that for the driver's side, with the gasket that has a little curve on it, has the holes on the back side back there, so that um, this is would be driver's side. And the passenger side would be wherever this curved side is, has the two holes on the back, so it'd be on the same side, because this is, whoops, this is the regular rectangle. That's how I'm gonna orientate it. Okay, if I would've fully read this, it says, do not, the bolts in oil. It's called just a hydro lock. So, <clears throat> but um, it says a non hardening sealer. That's what I should have used. I should have read it all the way. <clears throat> I forgot that this was in one of the boxes. Big mistake. Got to read everything. All right. So, what I'm going to do, kind of start over since I made the mistake, is <clears throat> I'm going to take some. Brake cleaner, even though I let some of the oil drain from the threads, 
I'm going to spray brake cleaner in there just to kind of get a restart. And then I'm going to use the ARP <coughs> fasteners. So I'm just going to kind of do that. Yeah, so I'll finish that up <clears throat> and then I'll let it drip and dry. I'm using the leftover ARP grease. This is how I'm fixing <laughs> the issue with the using dipping these bolts in oil. I should have known that. <clears throat> Everything I've researched, but make a mistake. So I just take the rag and wipe off the thread. Just taking this grease, whatever I had left over from the rods, and just get on each side, dab on the washer. So what I'm gonna do, is it right? I don't know, but I know that too much of this grease and stuff cannot be good. Of course, I'll finish it off with these these guys here. Just put a little dab on these, <clears throat> which shouldn't need a lot. These guys, but they also said too is on there is you want to put it on between the washer and the head too. So that's why I'm putting it on the washer. I mean, most of you guys probably know this, but this is my trial and error mistakes. <clears throat> and I'm really glad <clears throat> that I caught that the head was on, on the wrong, if <laughs> the head was on the wrong side. Um, I was really going by. It just didn't it didn't match up <clears throat> so anyway I'll torque these down to the sequence it's supposed to and really pay attention to that But mistake, so glad I caught it.